did you have any takeaways put it, you know implemented in your business that generated you better results? My biggest my biggest thing was just working on my media, which I learned cotton on a bit of that when I was there. You know, as in videos, as in social media, as in well, we don't do emails, but it was still a thing that we looked at. <laughs> Well, it's, 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 it's been funny the last couple of weeks. My staff have been bitching, going, "We're getting stupidly busy and we can't handle it." I'm like, but, yeah, "All my staff are commenting at the moment. We are flat out, and we're like, and all we've been doing is just good Facebook marketing. Well, so, it's good marketing in general." So, what you 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 came back with a, a, a better understanding of media. Mm-hmm. But also I came back because I had a good chat with um, the dude from America. That was probably one of the best things I ever did. Jordan was connect, connecting with Jordan because that actually, yeah, because he's the only other person who's really online with what I'm doing. I'm like, right, someone else who thinks like I do. Yeah. <laughs> and, I, yeah. and allowed me to actually go, okay, yeah, that's what, and I was able to go, okay, that's what Jordan's doing. Okay, I need to do the same. <laughs> and yeah, that, that connection with Jordan was actually probably one of the best things ever. Proved that I was going in the right direction. <laughs> And we've proven that now because we just jacked our prices up on our um, weekend package deals, which include the Dodgers, well, the Battle Cars, the Arcade Center, and the Laser Skirmish. Is that the second price increase you've done? Uh, yeah, we, we did a massive price increase at the middle in the middle of this year. Yeah, across board. Next is actually something I picked up from you too. Was look, don't be afraid to lift your prices. When my insurance went up six hundred percent, I'm like, okay. I'm passing that on to the customers. Oh, reminds me too, I need to order a couple of pallets of balaclavas before they run out. <laughs> yeah. Which is another thing I already sort of knew, but yes, make sure your supply chain is well and truly up to date before you don't have a supply chain. Hence, I was like the only one ordering stuff during lockdown. <laughs> yeah. You know, this is what I love about you. I, I, I ring you up. To, to, to pick your brain about the spectacular, and you ordered two pallets of balaclavas. <laughs> I got four. <laughs> East is real? Yes, because you got Pakistan's on the water. Okay, all all those things, can you put a figure or a percentage on, on, on what that's valued to you? Well, let's put it all into dollar figures. How much has my business expanded over the last two years? Two years ago, Richmond was bringing in $1.2 million a year. Now it's bringing in one... This year it's going to bring in at least 1.5, probably go as far as 1.6. Yeah. Let's look at all the stuff that I've been doing with Perth. Sorting out the supply chain, mm-hmm. courtesy of making sure we're getting all the right with you guys, and everything else and getting all the new carts. We've gone from less than a million dollars a year. We, the best year we had at that point was 800 a year. They bought is that both sides? Both, is that both sides? That's both sides. Both sides do the same. Just right, quite okay. fascinating when you think about it. Mm-hmm. Both sides last year bought in 1.4. So it went from, from 800, 800 to 1.4. This year they're going to finish at least 1.5, if not higher. I'm buying a Lamborghini next year, by the way. <laughs> We're running at Coburn at times 27 carts on track at once. And we still can't keep up. So Coburn's been quite funny lately, actually. The last few Sundays, they've been doing... Normally on a Sunday, they're doing, you know, five or six grand. Lately, they've been doing 12. So that's the sort of growth we've been seeing. Mm. But that all comes down to, like, the supply, you know, learning how which is probably one of the biggest things which everybody needs to learn is your supply chain and how to get your costs down, which is something you harped on a lot about in the thing. And that's bloody valuable. I was already doing the right stuff, but having your peer group around you um, saying you're absolutely on the right, right track allows you to go faster, quicker, and therefore get the results that you're looking for with, with, uh, yep. with the certainty. It gives, you, it gives you the confidence to know where you're going.